I was disappointing that uh, when things are obviously not going the way that I want, um, for that to be called into question by two um, two guys that I have a lot of trust, have a lot of faith in, um, that I've had a good relationship for a number of years. Um, I, I hate that that's where we are, but um, at the end of the day, you know, I know the work that I put in in the offseason. Um, I know the things that I try to make adjustments on, things that I tried to correct. Um, and, and it's frustrating for me every day to come in here and, and not see any, any return for that. So, um, yeah, I mean, it's obviously the way things are going right now. The, the last thing I want to hear about is someone within our organization questioning my work ethic, but I guess that's where we're at. Yeah, I'm not going to get in a fair and unfair. I'm, I'm going to be supportive of Chris in this because Chris works hard at his trade. And I think people a lot of time ago, he's not, you know, screaming and yelling and wearing emotions on his sleeve. You know, he cares to a fault. Okay, don't think for a second that he's just, well, you know, he, he, you know, I can tell you a lot of, I'm, I'm there personally seeing a lot of work that he and Scott do. And, you know, you know which day and, and what's considered uh, enough or not enough or whatever, I, I don't, you know. Certainly stay in communication in the off season during the season. You know, I just talked to Chris yesterday, spoke with him again today about some other things. But a lot of times just to check on how he's doing, you know, because it's tough. You know, tough sledding right now, real tough. And uh, so, you know, those are the type of things that, that happen, you know, with uh, when you're having the struggles that we're having. I don't have an issue with his, pro his comments. As far as him saying that I didn't work out with Chris, uh, you know, I worked with Chris about three times this winter, but nothing was talked about a physical change. A lot of it was more of the mental side of it, uh, about, um, you know, being more aggressive in the zone and, and, and swinging at pitches that he knows he can handle. And, um, you know, he, that was really all that was said. Um, as far as working with Chris, but it wasn't something that was on a physical change or, uh, you know, something that we were going to meet on a regular basis to, to do something drastic. Do you think there was a misinterpretation of some comments to lead to this opinion that you two didn't work together this winter? Well, I think the, the, the I don't think it's misinterpretation because I, I think what he's basically was reiterating to is that you know he felt like Chris needed to make an adjustment and he hadn't seen any and the same things are happening and um, I think that it was just a, a more of a, a comment to say look we've talked to the hitting coach and you know he basically hasn't done anything with him either as far as the physical change so I mean he wasn't lying about it or saying anything that uh, out of the ordinary I mean uh, that was the bottom line.